Hello, my name is Andrew Osterello, and I'm the Senior Research Statistician in the Scientific Learning Innovation and Research Department. In 2007, Scientific Learning introduced Reading Progress Indicator, or RPI. RPI is a reading and language assessment. This video reviews the key features of RPI, demonstrates its close relationship to a wide array of high-stakes reading tests, and shows how it can be used to forecast future district reading success. When we were building RPI, we wanted a test that would achieve the following four goals. One, be individually administered. Two, be short and easy to administer. We wanted a test that took students between 30 and 40 minutes to complete. Three, cover key reading and language skills, phonological awareness, decoding, vocabulary, and comprehension. And four, quickly and reliably detect improvements students make after using fast forward products. Extensive validation showed that RPI achieves all four of these goals. If we look at the academic calendar, we can see that most state reading assessments happen once a year in the spring. Though they are important for measuring student reading growth, they are infrequent. RPI is a good supplement to the picture of student reading growth. With a pretest in the fall and subsequent tests after completing each product, teachers can get more information to answer critical instruction questions. These questions are, who's currently succeeding? Who's on track with their reading growth? And finally, who's likely to do well on the state reading assessment? Now that third question can only be answered if RPI measures reading ability in a similar way to those state reading assessments. Does it? It turns out it does align well with state reading assessments. Here's an example from Florida. The Florida Comprehensive Assessment Test, or FCAT, has a developmental scale score which spans all grade levels. RPI correlates positively with this FCAT score. This chart shows the correlation is 0.51. Notice how well the best fit line fits the data. Of course, it's not perfect, but 0.51 is a pretty strong correlation, and it suggests that RPI measures the same kinds of reading skills that the FCAT measures. These results are not limited to Florida, of course. Here are four more tests that have strong positive correlations to RPI the ITBS slash ITED tests from Iowa, and the ISTEP from Indiana, two more state reading assessments. There's also the Gates-McGinnity reading test and the Woodcock-Johnson. Both are widely used supplemental reading tests. All of these correlations are well over 0.5, and all are statistically significant. Here is a list of the 12 states where we have positive correlations between RPI and the state reading assessment. These correlations get as high as 0.8, but none of them are below 0.4. Even 0.4 is very good. 0.8 is an extremely strong correlation. These states form a broad cross-section of the U.S. state test landscape, and our list of correlations is continually growing. So what can be done with these kinds of correlation data? Well, it's important to realize just how rich this data set is. We have matched data from over 25,000 RPI users and data from over 12,000 students who took state assessments and used fast-forward products. With strong correlations between the two, we can begin to predict student performance on state assessments by looking at the trends in a student's RPI scores. Not perfect predictions, of course, but we can build reasonably accurate mathematical models of student reading growth for a variety of states. One application of these models is the Reading Proficiency Growth Calculator. This tool allows districts to input simple summary numbers, such as the number of students in the district and the percentage of those students reading proficiently at grade level, and see what kinds of reading gains are possible for their students under a district-wide implementation of Scientific Learning's Fast Forward and Reading Assistant products. All of this is possible because of the mathematical models that carefully align RPI to state reading tests. If you're interested in exploring what these models forecast for your district, the Reading Proficiency Growth Calculator is free online at scilearn.com slash rpgc. Thanks for watching. For more information, please visit our website.